ไม่เอ่อไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ Uh, when I was six years old, six years old my mother took me to watch the movie Grease of John Travolta and Olivia Newton to John. This is the first moment that it's awakened my passion for dance when I was kids. So how did you feel after that? that uh, whether you were no. whether you were feeling trading, yeah, yeah. With people or not? Well, you started learning dance. Yeah, all my dance. All my life, I dance. I was start my practically my passion for dance at six years old. Later, when I was teenager, I wake up my passion again for the break dance and and for Michael Jackson. And when I was 17 years old, uh, one day I forgot the music in my aerobics class, and I play uh, party music, Latin music, and this is the moment I create Zumba. And um, now for me, it's so important to to. To spread spread up my 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 philosophy of, uh, about about Zumba because for me the life the dance is a celebration and it make people happy and smile and people now people teach classes and make money for me is is amazing. So what is the total explanation of the uh, word Zumba? It don't means nothing. That means nothing. The only when uh, this name born when 2001 when I was sit down with my business partner. And we need to create a name for 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 my class. And we sit down at one coffee shop and say, okay, tinga, tongo, conga, kunga, tunga, zumba. Hey, zumba, zumba sounds good. This is it, but don't miss nothing. So, uh, like uh, as we know that Michael Jackson is a great dancer over the world. So, how do you feel yourself? <laughs> comparison. I mean, no. I think that I am not a good dancer. I think I am a good teacher. I love to teach, and it's a big difference because uh, dancers love to. It's like a performance. I was a professional dancer years ago, working for Shakira, working for TV commercial. For I have my own company, but now I discover other passion is teach, and now for me it's it's amazing that people look at me like a superstar, but I don't feel like a superstar. I am one. Simple in Zumba instructor. So uh, during this period, did you feel any kind of difficulties? Like during this period, what was the toughest part? What was the toughest part in the journey? What was really the toughest part? And my ooh, first of all, is I think six months uh, for year I travel around the world. But when I am Miami, I I I live next to the, next to the beach, and I. Eat, uh, Training in the morning for my body. I I make cardio with Zumba classes and I train a little bit with weights. Later, I go to the office, my Zumba office. I have 250 employees there and uh, educational department, legal department, uh, video department, production department. I need to take a lot of decisions and meetings. And uh, I go to the office two to six or seven at night, and I come back to my home and try to. Eat and rest. But on the weekend, I try. When I am Miami, I will try to go to the beach, read a book, go to the movie theater, a nice restaurant, and spend time with my mother. Okay, now it could be a final, final question. Yeah. So you are in India. So how are you feeling? How are the people and how's the dancing? I feel like in Colombia, in my country. As uh, exactly like this, people love to dance, people love music, and I'm I'm very relaxed. When I teach a class tomorrow, this morning. Uh, and I feel like in my country, in Colombia. Thank you. Hi. I think Zumba means for me Beto, who started it, and uh, we're very happy to join with Beto with Bollywood flavors, and it's important because uh, he loves Bollywood, he loves Indian rhythms. So for me. Um, he called me and he said, "Chamak, we should do something together." So I'm here with him, introducing Bollywood flavors and Indian rhythms. So that's a great thing for us. And, uh, as I know that Zumba is something like kind of a fitness. So, what, according to you, what is it? I think Zumba is fitness, but it's also a lot of dance involved. And I think when my Bollywood dancing will start, do, you know, we'll start putting the Bollywood flavor inside. I think then they'll get more of the dance. But Zumba also is lots of dance. 
but it's also about fitness definitely Yeah. So how does he grow? I think um, from the time Aishwarya Rai won Miss India and uh, Priyanka Chopra, all were trained by me. And suddenly I hear that my Miss Universe uh, runner, 15th I think. I, I'm, I'm too impressed that she was my student. And she only said, Shamak, I was your student just to wait in line to say hello to you. Okay, anything else you want to share with your friends? That I think Beto... Uh, who is the you know the king of Zumba? Who created Zumba? He and I are very similar because we went through a lot of struggle, a lot of hardship, a lot of a lot of pain to come where we are. And for me to make dance in India, it was not easy. But eventually, I did it. And Dilto Pagale came, and then that changed the dance history in India. So the same way Beto did a lot of you know he struggled a lot to come where he was, and then he made Zumba world famous. So we're very similar in that way, and I'm very happy to be working with him. Yeah. You don't mind. Doom machale, doom machale, doom machale. Thank you so much.